Hi, I'm Mayor Andy Skibitsky, and welcome to TV36 and this special edition of Hometown. I'm here in downtown Westfield at the Downtown Westfield Corporation's seventh Girls' Night Out. So we're going to go visit some of the girls and see what they're doing tonight and visit some of the restaurateurs and shop owners. Well, Sierra, how are you tonight? Good. And what are you doing downtown? Going shopping. That sounds like a fun thing. Who are you going shopping with? My mom and aunt. And anything in particular you uh, want to scope out tonight? Uh, I want to get some jewelry from Alex and Andy's. Oh, very nice. What what in particular? Um, I don't know. I think like their new bracelets or something. Okay. Do you uh, come downtown Westfield often to shop? Mostly if I have time, yeah. And in one word, how would you describe downtown Westfield? Beautiful. And so are you. Thank you, Sarah. Mm -hmm. I'm at the grand opening of Alex and Ani with the store manager, Megan. Megan, how are you tonight? I'm doing great. I'm well, congratulations nice. on your Thank opening. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. So will you be here full time? Yes, I'm here all the time. Yeah, all the way till this evening. So. And were you familiar with Westfield before you became the store manager? Yes, I've actually been working in Westfield for six years now. Okay. So Great. I'm very ha happy to still be here. <laughs> so, what, for those that aren't familiar with the brand of Alex and Ani, how would you what, how would you describe it? Well, Alex and Ani is all made in America, based out of Rhode Island, made out of recycled metals. Um, it's just basically about spreading positive energy. Every single one of our bangles has a specific meaning that touches everyone in different ways and we help them kind of fulfill that journey when they come into our store. And what's the price point generally? Basically from 24 to 28 all the way up to a precious collection that we have up to 148. So a little bit for everybody. Yeah. Well congratulations again on your grand Thank opening. You so and Megan in one word, how would you describe downtown Westfield? Bump in tonight, definitely bump in with positive energy. So we're happy to be here. I'm with Mr. Ralph Steinhardt. Ralph, how are you tonight? I am in excellent shape. And you, Mayor? I'm doing terrific. So what's your role tonight here? In My what? Your role tonight. Uh, I'm a greeter. Uh-huh. Yes, it's... Uh, I've been doing this since we started this thing. It's uh, very exciting. I think we're having the biggest turnout we ever had. Uh, and uh, we're blocking traffic and we're doing everything right. <laughs> Is it tough being downtown greeting all these women? Love it. <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks for volunteering, Ralph. Right. <laughs> hey, so Ralph, I've been asking everybody, in one word, how would you describe downtown Westfield? It's vibrant. Excellent. Thank you very much. Right. I'm here with a couple of seventh graders from Watchung, New Jersey. Welcome, girls. Thank you. What brings you to downtown Westfield? Um, the girls' night out. <laughs> you? Yeah, just shopping. Is there anything in particular you're shopping for? Um, we're just looking. Yeah, we're here for Alex and Ani. Right. Do you own any of their jewelry now? Yes. Mm -hmm. Very nice. You guys go to the same orthodontist? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> your teeth look beautiful. Thank you. So um, I heard from your parents, they said spend a lot of money in downtown Westfield. Okay. And also, I want to ask you each to describe downtown Westfield in one word. Okay. And I never asked you your name. Give me your name first. Loren. Loren, how would you describe Westfield in, in one word? Um, fun. All right, good. And your name? Selene. So, Len, how would you describe downtown Westfield in one um, word? Happy. Very good. Well, thanks for uh, talking to TV36 and have fun tonight. Thank you. Thank you. I'm here with Nicole, who's visiting from Irvington. Welcome. Welcome. Thanks. What's going on tonight? Uh, a lot of shopping and some good stuff going on. <laughs> I see you. we're outside Urban Outfitters. Are you purchasing anything tonight here, Nicole? Not yet, but I'm looking to go in. <laughs> One of my favorite stores. Have you been to Girls' Night Out in Westfield before? Yes, every year. Very so. good. So you come back. You like what you, what you have here? Yeah, I'm a regular. <laughs> excellent, excellent. So you were here with one of your friends. What happened to her? She ran away. She's <laughs> camera shy. <laughs> so, Nicole, in one word, how would you describe downtown Westfield? Quaint. Quaint? Very good. 
Thank you for coming to Westfield. Very nice meeting you. Nice meeting you too. I'm here with Frank Arena, the senior first ward councilman. Councilman, how are you tonight? I'm doing great. It's always great to be here in Westfield on a beautiful night like tonight, and especially ladies' night out. Another great event. So is your gorgeous wife and daughter out here tonight? Uh, they're in town. I'm looking for them. They're probably shopping, so I'm going to flag them down and get them out of the stores as soon as possible. <laughs> <laughs> well, what, uh, what do you think about tonight? You know, I love this town, and events like this make it more special. Uh, the DWC, Sherry Cronin and Company, have done a great job. We've got hundreds and hundreds of women here. Uh, it just makes it just a special night for everybody, and I think our retailers really enjoy it, the restaurants. So it, it's a great day for Westfield, and we're going to have more of these, as you know, going forward. So this is very good for us. So, Councilman, in one word, how would you describe downtown Westfield? One word, I'd say uh, fabulous. Fabulous. Excellent, and uh, thank you for all the work that you do for the town of Westfield. Thank Council. you, Mr. Mayor, and likewise to you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm here with Westfield resident Liz Ryan. Liz, good evening. Hello, and uh, I'm with the New Jersey Festival Orchestra. I'm Director of Marketing for the New Jersey Festival Orchestra, and I'd like to share with you information about our upcoming tour of Notable Homes. It's going to take place on Saturday, May 10th at 10 o'clock. We have five fabulous residences. Uh, once again this year on the tour of Notable Homes and all proceeds will benefit the New Jersey Festival Orchestra. So we really hope you can join us. And Liz, how could they find out about it and purchase tickets? Well, there's information online at uh, NewJerseyFestivalOrchestra.org. Um, tickets are available online, $30 in advance, $35 on the day. The tickets are also available at our ticket outlets, Barron's, uh, the Town Books and Hallmark, Irma's Hallmark in Fanwood, Scotch Plains. Great, very good commercial and good luck with the event. Thank so Liz, you very in, much. in one word, how would you describe downtown Westfield? Tonight it's fabulous. <laughs> <laughs> Great, thank you very much. So good evening, I'm here with Becca. Becca, with brand new store in Westfield. Where Relatively are we? new, yes. We're here at Patisi on 41 Elm Street. And we've been here about almost two years, all costume jewelry for all types of occasions, young and old. And um, it's been a pleasure working here. I've worked in a lot of retail and it's been a really great experience. So uh, have you been familiar with downtown Westfield before you worked I here? I am. I grew up in Plainfield, New Jersey, went to school um, in Edison, a private school. And it was always a tradition for me and my mom to come downtown Westfield and get something to eat at Mojave or Ferraro's and go shopping and have a lovely girls night out or a girls day out for that matter. Very good, Becca. Well, so tell me a little bit about the jewelry that you have here. Um, like I said, it's all mostly costumes, so it's very um, elegant, classy, a lot of glitz and glam, definitely statement pieces. The brand um, Patisi stands for prominence in Latin, so we try and give each piece a little bit of prominence and uniqueness to its buyer. And um, we really have stuff for all occasions. Every day I bought stuff here for weddings, we do wedding parties, um, bridesmaids, flower girls, really a big array of stuff. Very good. You're right here in the corner of Quimby and Elm. Yes. And so, Becca, in one word, how would you describe downtown Westfield? In one word, how would I? Ooh, that's hard. Vivacious. Very good. Well, Becca, thanks for talking to no TV problem. 36, and uh, have a fun evening. Great. Thank you so much. So I'm here with, I'm sure, a very familiar face to many Westfielders. This is the executive director of the Downtown Westfield Corporation, Sherry Cronin. Sherry, good evening. Good evening, Mayor. How are you? I'm terrific. This is our seventh Girls' Night Out in Downtown Westfield. Tell us about it. Well, it's been fast and furious. This evening we had 2,500 women uh, pre-registered to come to the event from all towns in the state of New Jersey. Um, we do have a few from New York and Pennsylvania as well. And um, we have 92 businesses participating tonight, so there's lots of things for people to do. And of course, we're here in Alex and Ani, which is celebrating their ribbon cutting as well. Sherry, can you tell us some of the, some of the newer places that have opened recently in Westfield? 
There have been a number of grand openings recently. Um, Akai, Japanese Sushi Lounge, just opened, and they're doing a phenomenal job. Amuse, our new French uh, restaurant on Elm Street, just opened recently. And, um, of course, Alex and Ani. We do have some other openings that are coming soon. NNC Jewelers over on Quimby Street. Um, and um, we know that um, recently the Esprit building was leased, so that will be something that we can talk about soon. Two new ones that we did for um, the um, Details Made Simple and JL Makeup Artistry um, at 231 North Avenue above Lamani Seafood Grill. Very good. And so can you tell us about, uh, I see a lot of women walking around with bags, and those are like, the, the women that pre-registered for the event, and what do they get? Well, um, there is a bag uh, given to them by um, David Realty Group. He's our bag sponsor this year. And um, in our registration area, of course, there are a lot of coupons and giveaways. But really, it's not about the gift that they get because tonight, Lord and Taylor gave the first 1,300 women a free umbrella. Um, and if they were not one of the first 1,300, Morgan Stanley gave them a compact that went along with the bag. So um, there's lots of free giveaways and goodies for people to enjoy, but really it's about what's happening in the stores itself. Well, Sherry, uh, the, you and, the, and your board at Downtown Westfield Corporation Board do a wonderful job uh, supporting Westfield and the, and the merchants downtown. So keep up the good work, and we'll see you around tonight. I'd be remiss if I didn't mention Beth Brenner and Jamie Lindbergh, uh, who are part of the DWC staff, and we work really hard for this event particularly. It's become a really large event for us, almost, almost as big as the 5K <laughs> pizza run, but not quite. Well, thank you, and, and thanks again. Hi, Andy. Hello, Roseanne. How are you? <laughs> this is my first time at Ladies' Night Out. I've lived in Westfield for 18 years, and I'm so excited. It's a beautiful night, and I'm having fun. And where'd you move from with that southern accent? <laughs> Staten Island. Uh, okay. <laughs> well, uh, wh what are you doing downtown? Who are you hanging with? These are my friends. Mm -hmm. Say hi, everybody. Hello. And what's on the agenda? We just shopped. I just bought a pair of shoes, and we're going to go eat at 16 Prospect. Very nice, very nice. So, Roseanne, in one word, how would you describe Councilwoman Joanne Nealon? Amazing. Okay. Fabulous. <laughs> now, in one, in one word, how would you describe downtown Westfield? Awesome. Great. Well, thank you. I'm with Cynthia, the store manager of South Moon Under. Cynthia, it's good seeing you again. Oh, good seeing you. Thank you. Welcome. Thank it's you. just chaos here. Yes. <laughs> Well, how long have you been open now? We've been we opened um, second week of September. So okay. yeah, yeah, it's been really great. This is actually um, the first girls' night was actually our grand opening, so it was even bigger than this. But we're so glad with the turnout this evening. So it's nice. It's nice. So how's how's it been so far? Business has been good. We've gotten a really good reaction from um, everyone in town. So it's really nice. We get a lot of the same faces and new faces tonight. So it's nice. Well, yeah. So Cynthia, those people that don't know South Moon Under, how would you describe what you have here? Um, I think it's like a mix of everything. We kind of have like the mothers come in and they bring their daughters in. There's a kind of like a whole collection of um, items from all generations. We don't carry just one brand. Uh, we carry sometimes over 500 brands at once. So it's nice that everyone who comes in will walk out with something. They can find something for themselves. Yeah. Yeah. So Cynthia, in one word, how would you describe downtown Westfield? Oh, beautiful. <laughs> beautiful. Yes. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. That's it. I'm here with two friends of mine, Ellen Bird and Janet Westerman. Ellen, how are you tonight? I'm very well, very well. Very nice evening tonight. Enjoy. And you're, you're visiting from Cranford, correct? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. So what's, what, what do you and Janet have planned this lovely evening in Westfield? Well, we've just gotten here, so we're just starting out, and we're just taking a view of everything and getting to know what's going around here. It's the first time we're doing this. Well, your husband's called and said it's been a lot of money. <laughs> That's good. I'm yeah, glad about yeah, that. Yeah. <laughs> So, uh, Ellen, in one word, how would you describe downtown Westfield? Beautiful. Very good. And so are you, Ellen. <laughs> and Janet Janet actually uh, grew up in Westfield, doesn't live in Westfield anymore, but is here often. So, Janet, how are you tonight? I'm very good. And w tell me about your memories of Westfield. Uh, Ferrero's, the Rialto, this used to be a bank over here. Mm -hmm. um, just being, walking around here with my parents and uh, having a good childhood in Westfield. So besides shopping, what else are you going to be doing tonight, Janet? Eating, drinking wine. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> All right, Janet. So in, in one word, describe downtown Westfield. 
exciting, delightful. I just love it. So I'm here with Tara. Tara, how are you tonight? Good. Where are you from? Roselle Park. And what brings you to downtown Westfield? I shop here. Yeah. Are you here for Girls Night Out? Yes, for Girls Night Out. And what's on the agenda, Tara? I don't know yet. I'm just going to go in a couple of stores. I know I want to go to Alex and Angie. Yeah, I was just serious. Very nice. Very yeah. nice. Yeah. yeah. Say hi. So who's this? My niece. Hi, my name is Jordan. Hi. Jordan? And I want to be on TV. You're on TV. Who did your hair? It's beautiful. My mommy. Ah, and that, you look very, very snappy there. I like that coat. Say thank you. Thank you. I have a red coat. And how's your aunt? Is she nice? Yes. You sure? Yes. All right. Well, thanks for coming downtown Westfield. Say thank you. Thank you. Right, thank so you. one more thing. What, so what is it? In one word, how would you describe downtown Westfield? Oh, I love it. Right. Food, everything. Great. <laughs> Sorry. I'm at Soleil Shoes with Anna. Anna, how are you? I'm fantastic. We're having an incredible night, beautiful weather, great people stopping in, enjoying the great deals and the food, and it's a stellar night for us. And uh, it should be because you have such a beautiful store. And how many years have you been in a new location? It'll be 13. Oh, in the new location, it'll be five years in July. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. So f those few people that haven't been here, how would you describe your, your store? I think this is the place you come to find things that you don't find anywhere else. This is an exceptional place for style, mm -hmm. quality, and customer service. Very good. <laughs> well, and in one word, how would you describe downtown Westfield? Exciting. Right. Well, thank you very much. It's great seeing you. Great to see you, too. Enjoy the night. I'm here with Third Ward Senior Councilman Mark Legrippo. Councilman, how are you this evening? Good, Mayor. How are you? I'm doing terrific. Uh, thanks for helping out tonight. Uh, great. I love uh, the opportunity to come down in uh, beautiful downtown Westfield. Great place and a beautiful evening this evening. And is your beautiful wife and daughter down here tonight? Uh, no, they're not. <laughs> you might want to loosen that wallet up a little bit. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So I'm on my way to uh, Alex and Annie. Uh, very nice, very nice. So, Councilman, in one word, how would you describe downtown Westfield? Awesome. Very good. And thank you for all the work you do for the for the third ward residents and all the residents of Westfield. Thank you, Mayor. Have a good evening. So I'm here with Ed from the Farmhouse Store, which I'm sure many Westfielders have been to. Um, but if you haven't been in a Farmhouse Store, I encourage you to come. And Ed, why don't you tell a little bit about your your beautiful store here? Thanks. Um, we are a two-story store here, half right. gift downstairs, and then upstairs we have our home store. It's about 10,000 square feet of home store. And you actually have a second store location. We do. We have my brother and his wife opened our second store in Princeton about a year and a half ago, right on Palmer Square in Princeton. And you had quite a little special event tonight. What, what was all that about? <laughs> we had the number one sales Tupperware saleswoman in North America, Aunt Barbara, come, and she's right now, as we speak, doing her show in there, and to couple hundred women in there who are just having a great time. <laughs> great. Well, Ed, uh, in one word, how would you describe downtown Westfield? Vibrant. Well, good, and it's great seeing you as always, Thanks, Ed. Andy. Always and great to enjoy the rest here. of the night. Thanks a lot. <laughs> I'm here with Patricia from Patricia and Paul's. Who they, and Patricia and Paul's, congratulations, just celebrated your first anniversary in Westfield. It's been a wonderful year. It's hard to believe how fantastic this year's been, and uh, the, everybody in Westfield's been so welcoming, and we've really had a great time. So uh, is the first year what you expected? The first year, it's... You know, it's nice because we got past all the firsts. So now we know what the first holiday season looks like, the first Easter now. Um, so hopefully, um, taking good good notes, I'll be able to even be um, better next year. But it uh, it has been wonderful. It's, it really has been everything that I've hoped it would be. So Patricia, for those few Westfillers that haven't been to your store yet, how give a give a. 20 second commercial. A 20 second commercial. We are an olive oil and balsamic store. We have over 50 varieties. Uh, we have plain extra virgin olive oil that's ultra um, ultra premium olive oil. We have a um, we have the fused and infused um, which are absolutely delicious. We have garlic and basil, herbs de Provence. Uh, we have the balsamics, uh, which the, still, after a year, the town favorite is absolutely the fig. Uh, we have a chocolate balsamic. Um, and we've got some wonderful ones now for the, uh, 
for the w warmer months. We've got a nice uh, grapefruit one, uh, pomegranate and quince. So we've got some wonderful ones that are not only great for salads, but great for marinating, cooking, even baking. What's your most unusual flavor? Um, I still think people are surprised when they hear chocolate balsamic, um, but that's wonderful over fresh strawberries, um, even gelato, things like that. So that's, that's probably, uh, and there's a delicious one, a honey ginger, uh, that's excellent if you want to give an Asian flair to anything you're cooking. So those are some of the more unusual ones, but uh, um, again, very popular. Well, that's great. Patricia, I'm glad you're doing so well. I'm not surprised with your energy and your husband Paul's energy. And uh, so, in one word, Patricia, how would you describe downtown Westfield? I think it's still, as I said, it's been fantastic. I love the fact, you know, we had a tough winter, you know, so it's nice that the town does events like this to get everybody back in and supporting the downtown merchant. Um, so it's just, I, you know, again, I, I said welcoming, um, but also supportive. And I think that's what makes Westfield such a wonderful place to have a business as well as to live. So I'm outside of Akai, the brand new restaurant in downtown Westfield with the owner, James. James, how are you? Pretty good. How are you doing? I'm doing terrific. Tell us a little bit about your, your West restaurant. Um, our restaurant is um, it's a lounge slash sushi with a little a Latin twist to it. All right. And uh, we have a lot to offer um, from raw fish to cook items and a lot of wonderful appetizers. And what brought you have another restaurant, correct? That is correct. We have another location in Englewood. And, and you know what? This town is just as beautiful as Englewood. So here we are. And so how long you've been open for a few weeks now? How are things going? In, th thank God everything is going OK. Uh, it's a little bit of craziness. But you know what? We're trying to manage it and try to satisfy everybody. And what's your favorite dish? My favorite dish has got to be our Grilled Chilean sea bass. Our Chilean sea bass is probably one of the best fish on the menu. All right, good. All right. Well, James, in one word, how would you describe downtown Westfield? Exciting. Exciting. Beautiful and exciting. Great. Well, thank you, James. I'm here with Joan Blake, a Westfield resident. Joan, how are you tonight? I'm great. How about yourself? I'm doing terrific. So how's girls' night out been? Terrific. All the stores are busy. Everybody's out. Nice weather. Beautiful town. I'm happy. Have you had dinner yet? Yes, I did. All right, all right. Well, Joan, uh, how many how many times have you been to Girls' Night Out? Ever since it started. Wow. So this is the seventh time. I'm glad. Seventh time, yep. I'm glad you're consistent. So in one word, Joan, how would you describe downtown Westfield? Wonderful. Great. Nice town, nice people, and it's a real town, not just something you drive through. I'm here with the Vaca family. Good evening. How are you? I'm doing terrific. So why don't everyone introduce themselves? I'm Gallo. Taylor. Tyler. I'm Victoria. Victoria. And I'm Brianna. Brianna. Well, good. Welcome to uh, Girls' Night Out. You guys having fun? Yes. Uh, Mom's going on a Girls' Night Out, and Dad's going to have a dinner date with uh, his family. Oh, nice. Nice. Have you guys done any shopping? Um, no, not yet. No? Not yet, but we're going to later. How about you? Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so what what school do you guys go to? I go to Edison. Oh, nice. And I go to Tamaquis. Where do you go, Tyler? PK. Where? PK. 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 Very nice, very nice. So I'm going to ask you one word, okay? i ask you one question. I want to, in one word answer, what's the best thing you love about downtown Westfield? Okay? Everything. Very good. Um, I like going shopping. Nice. The stores. The stores. Everything. Very oh good. God. All right. Well, thanks. Thanks for talking to me. Thank Have you. a great night. Thank you. Have a great yeah. evening. Hey, thank you very Take much. Thank I'm here with Westfield Special Police Officer, actually Captain John Morgan. Captain, how are you tonight? Just great. And I see you've been you've been volunteering. I have been. And how's the atmosphere? Wonderful. Very good. Very good. So, uh, what's uh, new around town that you most excited about? Well, there's a new uh, Japanese restaurant right on Broad Street, mm -hmm. so I'm very interested in stopping in there this evening. All right, Captain, in one one word, describe downtown Westfield. Great. Very good. Well, Captain's good seeing you, and, and thanks, for, thanks for being in Westfield. Mayor, always a pleasure. Okay. Thanks for watching TV 36, and I hope you enjoyed Girls' Night Out. And I just want to remind all Westfielders to remember to shop Westfield first. Whenever you want thinking about shopping or dining or use professional services, uh, remember to come to Westfield first. If you can't find in Westfield, you don't need it. Thank you very much.